Hello and welcome back to the Baseball Youth Elite 25 D1 Rankings powered by Triton and CustomBaseballJerseys.com. I'm Jamie Valveno, the Director of Baseball Youth, and I'm joined by our ranking sage, the seer of stats, and the number whisperer himself, Anthony Grassi. Hello, Jamie. All right, Anthony, I have reached maximum anticipation, and like our viewers, I can't wait to find out who made the top five. Are we ready? Let's do it. All right, here we go. At number five, it's Kangaroo Court Ruse from Tampa, Florida. Last season's number three squad with another strong campaign winning the Slump Buster Championships in Omaha and the TBS National Championships at Lake Point against the 25th ranked Bandits. From South Lake, Texas, our number four team is Texas Canes Elite. Texas Canes Elite posted a 61 and two overall record and took an outrageous plus 58 run differential into the title game of the Elite World Series where they came up just short against the squad yet to be revealed in our rankings. Checking in at number three, we have from Norwalk, California, MVP Hustle Casillas. The 11U MVP Hustle Squad took the USA Baseball Futures Invitational title in Cary, North Carolina, beating number 22 FCA Blue Cause Hanna, number 13 Stars Baseball Camp, and number eight Banditos Black en route to the title. And at number two, it's Marucci Elite Nava from Houston. Marucci Elite Nava capped off an amazing year with a PG World Series championship over number 11 East Cobb Astros Orange, a team that has been on the national stage for a couple of years. Coach Victor Nava noted that keeping the core group of players together has been the key to continued success. And this year's number one team is the pride of La Abra, California. It's Easton Top Notch National. Top Notch National goes back to back as a number one ranked squad this year in 11U. Another amazing season, winning over 90% of their games and first place trophies from the U USA Future Series, International World Series, and the stacked Elite World Series, well deserving of our top spot. Man, these number two and these number one teams were really, really close. Grassi, what'd you look at to compare them? So obviously the overall records speak for themselves, but the big tournament wins are what stands out. Two big tournament wins for East and Top Notch, one big tournament win for Marucci Elite, and the overall head-to-head -head matchup in the semifinals of the International World Series proved to be the difference. Congratulations to East and Top Notch and to all the teams in this year's rankings. For Anthony Grassi, I'm Jamie Valvano. Thank you for watching, and be sure to check us out at BaseballYouth.com, and follow us on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter at BaseballYouth. Don't forget, tomorrow we rank the 12U teams, and Anthony, I know you had fun with that group. In the meantime, let's take a look at some of our Baseball Youth Elite studs who compete each year in and on Baseball Youth teams on national tournaments at the likes of the Ripken Experience, Disney's ESPN Wide World of Sports, and other well-known locations. Connecticut. New York. Canada. Connecticut. Canada, Connecticut. Canada, Connecticut. Baby. I'm up now. Up. Good job, Davi. Hey, Luke. How was that? How was that hit? That in the game? It felt pretty good. Hey, there you go, kid.